morning golfers. Uh, this week's two minute tip is a couple of basics on putting that we see quite often that causes a lot of problems to people. Um, mainly distance control. When I see people putting, um, they tend to dis uh, struggle with controlling their distance, whether it be 10 foot, 20 foot, 30 foot. And the main thing I see is as people make their stroke, they tend to make either too long a backstroke and slow greatly down into the impact, causing it, well, making it very difficult to control your distance and, and quality of strike. Uh, or the complete opposite, having the same length of stroke, whether someone's hitting a three foot putt or a 30 foot putt, they just tend to hit harder at the stroke. Really, we wanna try and keep a nice even tempo to the length of the stroke. Uh, the best way to try and obtain this is by having the same length of backswing as through swing. Yeah? So back, two foot, through two foot. The other thing I seem to uh, see quite a lot of is the Y shape that we naturally gain when we set up to the, to the putt tends to break down a lot in people's stroke as, the, as they make the stroke, uh, as they make the hit on the ball. And we really want to try and make sure that we concentrate on maintaining that. That really helps us keep the putter looking at the hole as we swing through, but also helps us make a nice consistent strike. It helps us bring the, uh, the putter face back to the bottom of the stroke in the same spot every time. So, if we've got a 10, 12, 15 footer, for example, I'm just gonna try and take the putter back 18 inches, 18 inches through. We've got a little right to left putt. So I've got a few inches right of the hole. Same back, same through. Nice consistent strike on the back of the ball. Good distance control. So what I'd recommend to you when you set up to your hitting some putts, maybe from 10 foot and in at first, and then start to work on greater, longer distances, is set up with two tees spread apart. One is making, marking your backswing and one is marking your follow through. And at first, however far you part you put them, just make your backswing and your follow through to those points. and see how far the ball goes. Then see if you can, can, can copy that distance same, same time and time again. And that's what we're looking for. Then to gain more distance, we're simply going to widen those two tee pegs for your length of backswing and follow through, or shorten them for the shorter distances. At the same time, as we said, Trying to make sure we keep our Y position, the put putter shaft being the stem of the Y, the left and the right arm being the, the arms of the Y. And then we're just gonna try and make sure as we make that even length of stroke either side of the ball, we're gonna try and keep that Y position the same. With that, we'll have better control of distance, much better quality strike, and therefore hit a lot more putts online with the correct distance control. Hope that helps. Any problems with your putting you want to discuss with us, uh, through this newsletter you'll see the, uh, the little button to push. Push that and you can book up an appointment with us straight away. Many thanks.